we found out that he had actually eaten two garter snakes. Um, so we removed uh, about a snake and a half. There's a couple different reasons why we've started to see more animals coming in. Uh, as of late, with the severe storms that have come through the area, uh, unfortunately some animals are getting blown out of trees, out of nests, uh, little baby squirrels are getting knocked out of the trees. And without mom in sight, so they come here and we play surrogate. Our goal is uh, for any animal that comes in to be released back into the wild. As everybody with uh, financial um, issues are, are always a part, um, making sure you have the proper funding, uh, making sure we're getting the supplies we need. Um, with the increased number of animals, the more supplies we need. Um, and that can be monetary donations, uh, in-kind donations, or basically supplies. Uh, we do have a baby, wish, a baby wish list and a general wish list on our website, babytowildlife.com, uh, that people can go on if they're interested in sending us supplies or a donation. It is hard. You feel bad, but you also know that you're helping them, and you get to see awesome recoveries. So We also have uh, Walk for Wildlife coming up in about three weeks on September 21st. It's a great opportunity for people to come out, visit the sanctuary, see the grounds, and also meet some of our fantastic animal ambassadors here.